Now, if you want to um see this, if you want to if you want to see this breaking news, um, we're gonna drop the I'm dropping the breaking news today on my channel today. So you need to be subscribed to this channel. Please hit the like button for me. You can go back and check out all the other content as well. But today, you guys, I'm dropping some breaking news on the FBG duck case. And this news that I'm dropping today has nothing to do with the federal paperwork, nothing that has been presented in court. You see, I'm dropping breaking news on the FBG duck case today. So best thing you could do is be over here today. I'm not going to directly drop the time. So if you subscribe to me, you will get the notification. The reason why I don't um, stop directly dropping the time when I'm going to drop the video is because the people get all their little bot comments and those things like that ready to try to, um, to um, try to manipulate my views. You understand what I'm saying? But today, you guys, it will be breaking news dropping on the FBG duck case. None of this information that's good being dropped tonight is in the paperwork or none of that. So what I'm going to need y'all to do is be there or be square. You see what I'm saying? Because now we got some breaking news in this information right here, y'all. It's going to um, it's, it's, it's going to it's, it's going to basically change a lot of things. It's going to change a lot of things. You guys Well, I have I don't want to speak too much about this information and um, what the information going to be about or what it's pertaining to or what direction it's going out of none of that. But um, if you're on this channel today, you will see the breaking news from FBG duck case and the FBG duck. Muwap, Fun, O Block Five. If I said O Block Six today, that's my bag. Just like um, what was that? What was that? I meant to tell y'all. Oh, that was my bag, you guys. When I was doing the Cairo video, and I start, I was saying Crazy James at first, and then I start saying Baby James. So I know people right here he said Baby James, but you know I know I, one of my little guys named Baby James, so that's why it was kind of like stuck in my head like that. But you know that was my bag. Shout out to Crazy James. Shout out to all of No Limb over there. Shout out to Cairo, the Joker. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And y'all already know what's up with that other dude, man. We not going to talk on Mr. Wiley because Mr. Wiley is out here doing a lot of devious things. You see what I'm saying? A lot of things that's being swept under the table as well. And then if you haven't one checked out my video about, you know, um, the, 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 the rat is down there in California. He's actually getting ready for his no jumper video. You feel me? He's ready for his no jumper video. Everyone going to tune in and listen to it because they're going to try to see what he has to say about the whole um, snitch allegations and things like that. But I already know what's going on with your snitch allegations and things like that. And some of that might pop up in this breaking news in this video um, that's going to be dropping on my channel today. So like I said, you need to be there and be square, but it's definitely breaking news in the FBG duck case. You heard me? And another thing, I'm just curious of what he's going to have to, what, what he's going to say on the, um, on Vlad anyway. I'm curious of what this guy going to say on Vlad anyway. You see, because if we really look at the situation, he really can't say nothing. You see, <laughs> everybody be talking about, see, this is what trips me out. Here's another thing that trips me out about these people. Everybody be running around to my, yeah, you know, you can't officially call nobody this or that if you ain't got the paperwork and all that. But guess what, y'all? When the paperwork is right there, they still rock with the dudes. You see what I'm saying? Tell you, say for instance, like I said earlier, look at the 6 9 thing. The paperwork is right there, man. It's right there. Just like this dude, the paperwork is right there. Just like butter, the paperwork is right there. It doesn't it seem like, listen, y'all, check this out. Check this out. Check this out. And everybody knows this. Doesn't it seem like the more the more um, that the snitch allegations come out on Butter, the bigger his career get. Just pay attention. Just pay attention to little Butter. Listen, right now, look, right now, Butter is famous, more famous than a lot of the FBG members. He's more famous than Lil' Jack now. You see what I'm saying? But guess what? Some way, somehow, Butter can get on all these videos and I'm going to do all these interviews and stuff, y'all, and talk on there and like basically make people forget about what he did. You feel what I'm saying? That's because he's getting promoted. You see, they're, they're promoting the snitches, man. They're, they're promoting the snitches. Listen, 
if y'all really look at this thing, like all this stuff from Butter crying in the car, from this and that, from Butter telling on Lil J, from all of this stuff, the Butter in that sanitary game, Butter in FBI paperwork and everything, Butter that had 3,000 interviews already. You see what I'm saying? So the more money, you got to understand, especially people who interview him. Okay, I understand it's a hot story and all this, but reason why I stay away from mother like that, say like if I was a big interviewer like that, would I put Duck or Trenches News? Would I go get them? And no, reason why I'm not going to go get them because my whole thing is this. I know they want the story and it's all about this. Everybody want to hear the story. But the reason why I'm not going to go get them because you got to look at it like this. You have to pay him to come give you an interview. Why would I pay a snitch to come tell me how he told on somebody? It just doesn't make sense. And that's the only problem I have with it. That's just my opinion. That's not to take nothing from everybody else who do interviews on these boys or nothing like that. But no, from a real perspective, I look at it like, nah, it it, it ain't that serious. I'm not going to pay no rat to come tell me how he told on some other dudes. For for that right there, I got enough views. I got enough subscribers. I just record some of the video that he took off there and just break it down on my own channel. You feel me? But I'm not going to pay him to come give me no interview and he's a rat. You feel me? And then you have people locked up and all that. I'd rather take the money. I'll probably um, do a video Video that go viral, me just taking the money and giving it to the dude, whatever I was gonna pay you four, five thousand, six thousand to come do an interview, no matter whatever they charge, three thousand, fifteen hundred. What I might as well send that to the person that you told on to put that on his commissary books. I think that video uh, uh mean more sense and probably it'll go more viral than the other one. See, I look at things like that. You see, just because he in the news, he in the news for telling. You feel me? So guess what? I'm the type of person I'm not gonna go get the person he told that told. I'm going to get the person that he told on. If I go interview the person that he told on, I don't need this dude that that told, you see, because you hear it right out the horse's mouth. You feel me? So that'd be my whole thing about the whole interviewing the snitches and rats and stuff like that. It just seems like to me like that you were just promoting the snitch because y'all put them on some type of pedestal like they're important. They, they're not important. How is they important and they have all these people incarcerated? This is why I say the whole game is twisted up backwards right now. The whole game is twisted up backwards. Because this, oh, it just be crazy because you, listen, y'all, you never see the dude get interviewed who got told on. Isn't this crazy, y'all? You never see the people who interviewed who got told on. Just like, let's say, let's give, let me give you another example. The 1090 Jake situation. You see, like they running all around. Everybody want to. Um, here 1090 J. Let's have 1090 J play. It's somebody else put him on on live. Now he on there talking about it. now 1090 J is talking about it. Now everybody is putting up the video of 1090 J talking to it. Now all the um, no jumping all in want to go interview 1090 J to um, talk about these snitch allegations and things like that. I think you'll do better if you go get the dude that he told on because and, and interview him because at least that'll be good giving that dude a little clout. You see what I'm saying? He probably could start his own channel, do the at least it'll be giving him a little clout and stuff like that. You feel me? Why to you know he the one lost out, he the one got told on, he the one went to jail, he still got children and all that stuff like that. Why interview the snitch? Why give them the promotion? That's the only thing about it that doesn't make sense to me. Like I said, I'm gonna keep stipulating this. Um, that's not to know any Pacific, um, people who do interviews or whatever you do. That's your, that's your thing. That's, that's that, but it's just my opinion on it and my feelings about it is I'm not going to do it. It just don't make sense. I'm not paying no snitch to come up here and tell me how to hold on some more people, especially a six and nine. You will pay this dude to come up here to tell you how he told on all your brothers. You feel what I'm saying? It doesn't make sense. You feel? And that's the same thing how I look at the situation with Whack with him. You see what I'm saying? Whack, you're going to have to snitch get buddy that snitched on all your alleged gang members. It doesn't matter if they're from New York and y'all from Cali and y'all to my Cali bloods and New York blood. Blood is a blood, man. And then basically the way Whack talk is you ain't supposed to tell on no man. You see what I'm saying? Civilian or nobody. Whack just went off on 1090 Jake. Said 1090 Jake snitched on the police, uh, <laughs> the, the, the correctional officers, and the dude who told on him. That's like I told you. told on the dude who told him. But you guys, y'all need to be over here on my channel today because I got breaking news dropping on the FBG duck case. And I'm going to stop running out from my mouth so much right now. You guys, please hit that like button. Please subscribe. I will be back. Same bad time. Y'all know that same bad channel. And I'm out. You heard me.